guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here bringing you this video today from the usual location in the home office here in Jerusalem. And as I say that, I realize I really need to find a better intro uh, for these YouTube videos. But uh, for the moment, this will do. Today's video is actually not about the usual stuff I talk about on these YouTube videos, which is Caden Live and Ubuntu Linux and uh, random stuff about Israel and whatnot. I've actually been doing a bit of thinking over the last couple of days with uh, what I'm actually doing here, putting videos up on YouTube in the first place. And I absolutely, firstly, the channel's not shutting down for those worried uh, that this is a end of, uh, um, this is a closing down announcement, not the case. But I have been realizing over the past few days that I need to kind of think a little bit more about the direction I'm taking. So when I started putting up videos on YouTube two years ago, thereabouts, I was just doing it because um, I've been sort of interested in content creation for really almost as long as I can remember, whether it's been blogging or podcasting. I always thought video was too hard and I kind of wanted to challenge myself to just try it, try putting together some videos and see how they turn out. I never expected anyone would actually watch or subscribe these videos, even though I've created a decent amount of videos. Um, it's still taken me kind of by surprise. So as that's kind of happened, the more I've got, also the more I've gotten into um, running this YouTube channel, the more I've become immersed in this world of video and actually found that I really, really enjoy it. Um, it's a nice blend of two passions of mine, which are firstly creativity, secondly storytelling slash journalism, and thirdly uh, technology. So more so than writing, I find video actually is a nice dovetail because you've got elements of creativity storytelling and you've definitely got a strong technical element. So I've been completely freestyling this YouTube channel as probably anyone who's dropped in here to watch a video uh, can see because the topics like one day it's Israel. There's been no strategy because I've never really seen this as anything other than a hobby. I never imagined I would even get to like 800 subscribers, let alone get to like 1000 to monetize. It just really wasn't on my radar at all. So now that that process is happening, people are actually subscribing for whatever reason. I'm still not entirely clear why people are subscribing, but I'm very flattered that I've reached, reached even this point of, uh, of success on YouTube. And as that's happened, I'm like, okay, well, if people are going to watch these videos, I probably do need to have a theme for the channel because I actually feel bad. On the one hand, I created YouTube with the idea of just like open sourcing what I think about, all my interest. If you want to watch, watch. If you don't want to watch, don't watch. But then I thought, well, that was great. But the fact that now after the fact people are watching... I kind of owe them at least some kind of a consistent viewing experience. Um, so I had to think about it and I decided that I am going to, even though it's going to be a lot of hassle and I don't really feel like doing it, I'm going to set up different channels for my different interests. So I want to, um, firstly, what are the channels going to be? That's what I need to figure out. And I'm going to sit down with a pen and paper sometime soon and figure out what my niches are. If anyone's been watching this YouTube channel, really actually following it, you probably know I have very specific interests. One of those being MDisc, amazing optical storage media, Caden Live, um, a video editing software I really, really actually have come to love. Um, so those are logical ones for me where I'm gonna like start a channel for Caden Live, Daniel's Caden Live tips. And there's also Israel. So for those who don't know, I do live in Israel. A lot of the videos I post up here are really, really basic how-to videos on anything I think might be useful to other people, whether it's, uh, here's how you find a doctor using your health service in Israel, or AliExpress is now in Israel. Here's how you buy stuff from AliExpress. Um, so what I've realized over the past couple of weeks is that, well, I don't know why anyone would actually subscribe to this channel because you might subscribe because you're like, oh, cool, this guy uses Linux or this guy uses Caden Live. Then you're like, but I don't really care about AliExpress in Israel. So I realized that as much as I'm having great fun uh, creating videos for YouTube and uploading stuff, um, I think it's reached the point where I need to like actually separate it. So the only thing I'm gonna say here is right now it's nebulous as to how it's going to go. If people are really interested in whatever reason, because I don't think I'm that interesting, maybe the stuff I talk about is interesting. If for whatever reason you do wanna follow like the stuff I specifically put out, 
uh, let me know in a comment and I'll send you links to like where the channel has gone. It doesn't mean I'm not going to be uploading on the channel. To the contrary, this channel is going to be stuff that is just kind of like random stuff that I put out. Maybe it's going to be like my personal blogs and opinions about stuff. But <clears throat> gradually, my plan is for um, types of content to stop being mushed into this channel. So it's less of a big mushy mess. So for instance, I mentioned the MDisc. I'm going to set up an MDisc YouTube channel. So people really care about MDisc. They can watch me talk until the cows come home about MDisc and what it is. I'm going to start one for my uh, the Canon XA40 camcorder because I've gotten to really know the camcorder pretty well. And um, I think if people are really interested in the XA40, for sure, I'll start. I'll have all my videos on a separate YouTube channel. I'm going to do one for Caden Live because that, again, is like very specific people who use that software can find my videos. And that's kind of how you want to go. And then as I sort of cut out niches that are best suited to separate channels. Oh, I forgot one that I've actually already set up. It's called, I'm looking here at my channel switcher list. It's called Living Well with Depression and Anxiety. And that's where I posted kind of my uh, mental health videos where I talk about depression and anxiety and living with those and taking medications and stuff that really is not of interest to people who aren't either engaged with mental health or have it or whatever. So that's the logic that I've chosen to follow. And it's going to be a slow process, an ongoing process, but this channel will hopefully as a result be less random or include less random things. Uh, so that's where I'm going with this YouTube channel. And my plan other than that, other than uh, separating this big mushy bundle of miscellaneous content into different parts is going to be to keep having a lot of fun with it. I'm now being paid for some video work, not by which I mean, I'm not taking on like freelance work, but I've started doing video as part of my job. Uh, I've started uh, selling stock video footage. So I guess I'm kind of a semi-professional videographer now, which is kind of awesome. Never thought I'd get even here. Um, so if you don't want to keep uh, subscribed to whatever else is coming out here, click the subscribe button and if you want to know where else my YouTube voyage has taken me uh, leave me a comment or I'll find some well maybe I'll put up a link tree link whatever I'll uh, let folks know thank you guys as ever for watching any thoughts on how I should split this channel up uh, leave a comment because your comments are great I got I think like 10 comments today and I'm and I'm at such a small level on YouTube that I can respond to even one. And they make my day, by the way. Like I was getting them as I was eating dinner and I was like, oh, this, I can't believe someone else cares about MDisc. I can't believe someone else cares about Caden Live. This is awesome. Uh, so right now I'm enjoying all of them. So thank you guys for watching very much. And uh, thanks for engaging with the channel so far and have a good day or night wherever you are in the world.